Hi, hi, Rap Squad! So, as you can see, ang ganda-ganda natin today. I'm in the mood na mag-ayos kasi nanalo ng Miss Universe si Miss Catriona. Great! Pero, alam nyo naman, habang gumaganda tayo, kumakalat ang ating kapaligiran. And speaking of kalat, meron akong i-introduce na mga kalat tonight, today, this afternoon, kung kailan ko man to i-upload. So, first up, we have Miss Albania! Albania! We need you. Albania! Ah, yeah. <laughs> yes. And then second one we have South Africa. Ah, so para sa mga hindi nakakaalam, <laughs> si Albania is si Chucky Hits, si South Africa is si Wilbert Francisco, and we have the Joa Wits of Wilbert, also known as Miss USA. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Next. And the one, the only trainer of the Queen's mother, <laughs> Queen Sita. <laughs> oh my god, Mother Sita. Yes. Na inspire ako gumawa ng video para sa aking channel kasi tingnan niyo naman, o di ba? Full package. Sabi nga niya, bili na kayo. Ito ang aming, na kami. aming bugaw. Bente tumpok. <laughs> Basically, ang gagawin namin is susubukan namin sagutin ng maayos ha? Yes. Ng okay. maayos yung mga Miss Universe 2018 questions. Yung top 5. Kasi 5 kami. So, na-screenshot ko na bawat isang questions doon. Tapos, isa-isa kami. Madetetermine kung sino mauuna by yung ganun din. Maibataya. Maibataya. Okay. So, first one. Try na natin. Ma iba. 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 Ma Beauty pageants would really depend on who or what kind of people are watching the, the pageant for the show. And that being said, it doesn't degrade any women because they represent different kinds of diversity of women all over the world. As long as, long as they have good intentions in representing the women of their culture, I don't see any problem with that. Hi. Iba? Parang tinaasan yung... Tinaasan yung lens. Yung isa at bars. We're set in the bars. Habang sumasagot si Sitang, narinig ko lumulunok ng malala si Miss USA. Sa likod. May paglunok. Hindi ba pwede tayo talaga? Translate. Okay. Oo, tayo na. Tayo na lang. Maiba taya. Maiba. Okay. Maiba. Saya. Ay! Maiba. Saya. Ay! Maiba. Saya. Ay! question is similar question with South Africa. Obrigado! <laughs> do you need do you need translator? No, no, no. Sige, <laughs> pwede kaya si Priscilla. Ay, dili ay dai. Dili. Okay. Do you think countries should limit the number of refugees allowed across their borders? Thank you for that question. In my own opinion, I think that the countries should not limit the number of refugees because these people help them in their economy by first working hard for their country and spending their hard-earned money in that country they are living in. That is all. Thank you. <gasps> oh my gosh! Okay, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Miss Albania, as to Puerto Rico, why is freedom of the press important? 
Thank you for that question. I think for me, it is very important because it actually spread, spread something. And what once it is spread to everyone, it cannot be undone. So basically, the importance of it was to spread the real news or to spread the truth. And that and that's all. Thank you. We are not for fake news. <laughs> Yes! Okay, so Miss USA, your question <laughs> is the hardest question oh, ever! <laughs> Tinanong to kay Miss Vietnam, the hashtag MeToo movement has sparked a global conversation. In response, some have said the world has become too politically correct. Do you think the hashtag MeToo movement has gone too far? This question is... <laughs> um, for me, I think it hasn't gone too far. Because... Some men... It's also harassed, but... They don't really have a voice. <laughs> and that's all. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wait, let's just say it. 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 let so, or so all, all, all sexual. All sex. Yun 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 Canada recently joined Uruguay as the second nation in the world to make marijuana legal. <coughs> what is your opinion on the regu <laughs> regularization of marijuana? Um, I personally think that marijuana can help a lot of people with diseases, and um, it it also be, it, it has been also proven that it can um, cure certain diseases like cancer and diabetes and all that. Things. Um, my standpoint to this is that <laughs> my stand <laughs> my standpoint to this is that Philippines should really consider um, really consider um, re um, legalizing marijuana because if it's really for health um, benefits of the patients that needed this, it could really help a lot of people with their um, disease. But um, the government also should have a concrete, uh, concrete stand or concrete plan, uh, concrete, yeah. concrete pa plan with the um, the recreational use of it. Because um, sometimes you know people, people when they get power, they abuse it. So um, uh, the the government should really have a good. Um, shit. <laughs> Oh, South Africa. <laughs> that, that's it. Um, they, they, sh they should really consider um, legalizing it for um, of medici medicinal uses. Yes! My stand for South Africa. But for now, um, we have time. Let's answer the question that they asked to all. The one question. Lang. What is the most important lesson you've learned and how will you apply it to your time as Miss Universe? Starting with... Baliktad naman. Oh, sige. Baliktad naman. Um, the, the most important lesson that I learned throughout my existence here is, of course, the um, compassion. Compassion towards women, compassion towards human, compassion towards animals, compassion all to all the living things here in our world because we only have one earth, we only have one planet we live in. So if we have compassion, if if we if we learn how to respect 
other people's opinion or other people in general, then there would be peace in this world. And as a Miss Universe, I advocate peace in this world because there are so many negativity things that is happening in this world right now and we don't need a lot of that. And if we learn how to love and just love, <laughs> then family is love. Family is love. love. Family is love. Kapuso. Ano ang buhay? Anyway, for Miss USA, what is the most important lesson you've learned and how will you apply it to your time as Miss Universe? There's nothing major, major. <laughs> um, I've learned that never to bully. <laughs> Um, wait. If I put it up, I'll love it. Next question, please. <laughs> okay, the next one is Miss Albania. What is the most important lesson you've learned, and how will you apply it to your time as a Miss in Universe? May pagtan ka. Ano? May pagtan ka din na ng wind. The most important lesson I've learned is that how to control the power of the social media. Because I believe that you always have to think before you click, before you spread something. Because you don't know how it will affect someone. How it will affect someone that would actually cause... Big? Hindi, hindi chaos. I think for me it's better to always remember think before you click. That would be I Malina. Okay, ask me the question. Shoot, honey. Okay. Miss Philippines. Oh my god. For Miss Philippines, what is the most important lesson you've learned? And how will you apply it to your time as Miss Universe? Thank you so much for that question. The most important lesson I've learned in life is to never take anything for granted because here in Earth, everything is only temporary, um, including our loved ones. So as, as, my, as being Miss Universe, I will continue to use my voice to spread awareness <laughs> <laughs> for HIV and AIDS, <laughs> kidding, I will really make the best out of it by just doing all the principles that a pr good person should be. Thank you. Wow! And last but not the least, Miss Sitang who has her own country, yeah. Sitang Nation. Yeah. <laughs> what is the most important lesson you've learned and how will you apply it? to your time as Miss Universe. I think the most important lesson I've learned so far is joining Miss Universe in general. Like as y'all know, I'm not a girl, I'm, I'm a boy. A not yet a woman? Yes, but dressing up in this way, dressing up, you putting makeup all over your face would take hours. And sometimes other people will just take that for granted, but they, they expect you to be a certain way if you're a woman. And oh. that also means that they devalue you in some ways because they think that you're just a woman and that's not right and if I were to be Miss Universe I would like to use and raise awareness that we should never devour women because they're just because they're just female because they're they're lesser of the two sexes that we have we should empower women by showing everyone that they're not just mothers they're not just sisters but they are human beings as well, and you don't know the difficulty that they go through every single day. Thank you. Yes! Maraming time. Maraming time na kapag is. Good! 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 Ayun na guys, ang aming mga questions, ay, ang aming mga answers sa mga questions from the recently concluded Q&A portion ng Miss Universe 2018. You be the judge guys kung sino ang mananalo sa amin, whether it be the four, Pocahontas, or the Buga, <laughs> Mother Sita. <laughs> Once again, yung kanilang mga channels, Chucky Hits, silang dalawa, Wilbert Francisco, and then si Steven Bansil. It's a wrap, guys, and I will see you guys again tomorrow. Wait, let's congratulate Miss Good Leo. Yes! Congratulations! Yes. Congratulations! Congratulations for the fourth yes. Miss Universe title for the Philippines! Yes, thank you! See you.
with you